Well, good late evening, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on May 17th, 2018. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. And we are watching here footage and pictures of Kilauea sending off a huge explosion and ash cloud 30,000 feet into the sky as golfers nearby are still carrying on with their, their daily fun. It's pretty crazy footage coming out of Hawaii right now. There's been over a thousand minor tremors since this event started over a week ago. And now there are over 20 fissures that have opened up since the caldera of Kilauea drained. We're looking at these huge blue flames shooting out of earth, fissures shooting out lava, scarring our land. Look at these pictures before and after. Pretty crazy. But they are on red alert, state of emergency right now. Hundreds of thousands of people fleeing their homes as these fissures are still pouring out lava. And these brave souls are still getting some awesome footage for us. God bless them. And God bless you for being here with me today. Here's an aerial view of the caldera now. Geologists, scientists are afraid of what Kilauea might do after today's explosion. They're expecting more. And most recently, we just had the 6.0 earthquake in the Kermadec Islands, just off of New Zealand, the coast of New Zealand. That was reported earlier today. Same with all these other 5.1, 5.2, New Zealand, and Japan as well, with a 5.8. It's a very tremorous day. A lot of earthquakes around the world. We're gonna to go to our map right now. You can still see here a pile of earthquakes in Hawaii and New Zealand. Papua New Guinea, 5.0, 5.1, 5.7. Tadine, New Caledonia, 5.7, L'Esperance Rock. And then 6.2 downgraded to a 6.0 in the Kermadec Islands, 10 kilometer depth. Jupiter is now leaning, or sorry, leaving our alignment. So hopefully this kind of calms down over the next few days, but I don't see that after so much happened in Hawaii. Still large movement in South America, 5.2 in Peru. This minor 4.4 in Iran. And this 4.2 in Jayaco, China. A lot of movement along our ring of fire. And the only quiet area is right now in North America. So this week we should see kind of a balance and hopefully it's nothing too serious, but there will be an uptick in seismicity along the San Andreas fault line and Cascadia fault line. As that large low pressure I was showing a couple days ago is still hammering the Alaskan Peninsula. Here we are now, this is the last seven days for earthquakes. Very busy map. And for those who have been watching my videos since the beginning of time, you'll, you'll notice a difference between a, a busy week and a non-busy week. And this is a very busy week for earthquakes. But you can see here, quiet in North America. To all my new subscribers, I wanna thank you for joining Morning Dew noticed a lot of new subscribers recently so thanks for joining I hope you enjoy the videos hope you learned something new share with your friends and family from across the world so you can stay aware and prepared for these events that are happening all across the world it's gonna leave you here with this footage of Kilauea Now 
to our five-day forecast for weather. Still watching this large low pressure system the size of Antarctica forming in the southern hemisphere. Been following this for a few days now. These storms just keep getting bigger. They come off the coast of South America and then they clearly gain strength by an upper high pressure ridge dominating the South Atlantic. We're also watching large low pressure development in Brazil over the next couple days. But it has been pretty quiet so far. No early hurricanes or super typhoons to talk about. So that's good. Hurricane season starts in 13 days. So we should see if we have any early Atlantic storms or Pacific storms. Looking over our nation, it's going to be dry for the next few days after we got some rain here in Alberta. It's not so dry, it's very nice. I'm gonna leave you here looking at the five day forecast map. Thanks for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Bye bye. Thank you.